anterior cruciate ligament or ACL reconstruction or ACLR is a surgical procedure performed to reconstruct a torn ACL in the knee. One of the techniques used in ACLR involves adding an iliotibial band-based lateral extraarticular tenodesis or LET to reduce the risk of graft failure. However, there are concerns that this additional procedure may lead to patellofemoral cartilage damage over time. To address this, researchers from Canada conducted a study to investigate the impact of LET on the health of the patellofemoral joint cartilage following ACLR. The study included 92 patients from Stability 1 trial and compared outcomes between those who underwent standard ACLR and those who received ACLR with additional LET. Using magnetic resonance imaging or MRI scans taken two years post-operation, the researchers assessed cartilage status in the patellofemoral joint of participants in the two groups. Additionally, they evaluated objective functional outcomes and patient-reported outcome measures or PROMs to understand the overall knee function and patient satisfaction. They found no significant differences in cartilage health between the two groups. Measures of cartilage relaxation times showed comparable results across various regions of the patellofemoral joint. Moreover, there was no observable difference in overall ACL osteoarthritis scores between the surgical and non-surgical knees within each group. Furthermore, while there were negative correlations between MRI relaxation times and functional outcome scores and PROMs indicating potential associations, these correlations were weak and their clinical significance remains uncertain. In conclusion, the addition of LET during ACLR did not appear to negatively impact patellofemoral cartilage health two years post-operation, although further research may be needed to fully elucidate its long-term effects.